it's hard work. Bill's taking cross ties out one at a time at there where it breaks. Uh, the water gushes in and keeps breaking right out there where he's working. So he took one of the, the cross ties from our pine trees where I have them laying there, putting it out here trying to uh, keep that water from r running off and direct it into our gardens. Uh, he's going to try to get more of them from the pine trees later. Well, that rabbit wire didn't work, so I had to put some stuff in there. They still come up and ate some of my plants. And uh, these are white onions. I don't know why they wanted them for, but I'm going to keep them in here. I put boards. I got stakes down through here, covering up all the corners. There was a mouse hole right through there. And, uh, so I'm putting boards in it, and hopefully that'll keep them out. Hey, are you helping? That's my helper. We're going to keep that old mouse out until you can go up and uh, catch one for me. Would that be good, boy? That would. You catch a mouse? Well, anyway, you can see they're working on it. I have a hole here right there you got one of the plants this one's been chewed on maybe that'll keep them out anyway I'm gonna go see what else I can bring out here are you gonna help help me bring them out here well I bet you will yeah you're a good worker he didn't know he was gonna come to a homestead and have to work Yep, we all have to work. <laughs> I was checking these and my potatoes are coming up. I'm glad to see that. It won't be long, they'll all be popped out. I had two containers of Swiss chard, and they really, really like the Swiss chard. Well. This is my sun chokes coming up. So they're activating. My helper. So in this bed, I gotta get some goji bushes out. Up here, there's one. And then there's one over there. I'm gonna get that out of here. Just doing some garden work today with my helper. He didn't know he had worked so hard. Yeah, you didn't know that, did you? This is where I'm putting a row of goji bushes on the walkway. Once they kind of establish themselves, I won't have to water them again. Because uh, they like dry feet. Well, the wind's coming up. So thanks for watching. From Mount West Homestead. Come in here, see what RJ's doing. RJ, what are you doing, boy? Huh, you taking care of your girls? You're awful good. <coughs> well, that was real good. Oh, you're a good boy. You girls like him? He's handsome, isn't he? He's a pretty boy. We call him RJ because I had a, a rooster I give Barbara. My daughter, uh, his name was Ringo, and this is Ringo Jr., and we call him RJ. And you don't have no spurs yet. He could be about 10 months old. I don't remember. But <coughs> he, he really takes care of his girls. Oh, RJ, your girls are leaving. Hey, your girls are going, and there they go. You just gonna talk to me? There goes your girls. I thought I'd come visit 
RJ and his girls. Hey, your girls are leaving. Yeah, what are you going to do? There they go. Well, he's worried now. Are you thinking about it? Okay. <laughs> I mess with him. <laughs> well, you better get in there with him. What'd you do? Call him back in here? Hey. RJ. You better go work on them leaves. <coughs> Says a screaming holler about it. Yeah. Go back to work, RJ. Look at that. Yeah.